this story for you. Officers arrested a man who they found on a roof after they say he crashed his car into a dentist office and then ran away. It happened along Smithfield Road and First Avenue in Nightdale. CBS 17's Randy Ayala joining us live right now from the dentist office with a look at the damage. What a wild story, Randy. Yeah, Bill, right. Pretty bizarre story here. We're going to get to the details behind it in just a minute, but I do want to show you the damage. But I have to say that crews really got to work pretty quickly here, diligently, because when we first got here, this entire corner here, you could see straight through the building, just a big hole. So they've got that boarded up, but I did speak to an employee here. Now she tells me this section of the building is actually her boss's office. Uh, so it's a good thing that this happened overnight when no one was here, so no one was hurt. But I do want to show you the damage when we first got to the scene. Take a look this video here. As I mentioned, you can see straight into the building, just, you know, a gaping hole. So a lot of damage, a lot of cleanup that's going to come with that. But let's get to the details because, Bill, you mentioned some at the top and it's just kind of crazy, right? So police tell us 52-year-old uh, Hodge Abdul Shabazz was driving with his headlights off when an officer tried to pull him over. He didn't stop, though. He ends up crashing his car right here into this dentist's office. Uh, police later found Shabazz hiding on top of a roof nearby because once he crashed, he just ran away. So he is facing a slew of charges right now. And I know police tell us that before this crash, Shabazz burglarized a tobacco shop that's about a mile away. Now, he was taken to the hospital. He was complaining to police uh, that he was sore. Uh, he was in some type of pain from the accident. So he is in the hospital. Now, that employee that I spoke with, uh, told me that uh, everyone who works here just really shaken up. They found out about it on their way to work. So you can imagine kind of showing up to your office with a chunk of the building missing. But this dentist's office was open today. I've seen patients uh, coming in and going out as well. Now that is the latest from Nightdale. Randy Ayala, CBS 17 News. Story, Randy, thank you.